Are you tired of feeders ruining your games in League? Skillcapped is an instructional site that will help you carry so hard it won't matter. With new video guides every single day, I highly recommend you give it a shot. Check out skillcap.com today. The good Castlevanias eventually came to Game Boy Advance DS, and then the series died because their console versions were awful, but Ripperoni. Ripperoni. That's a Konami franchise, right? So we're never going to see it again. Okay. Was the war this War Mine DLC worth buying? A lot of the viewers say it's pretty meh, so I have to see. We can play it tonight. I think it adds a kid, but the kid doesn't go outside. He has to stay inside, and you have to feed him. Yeah, the really old D DS or DSs could play Game Boy Advance, but then they phased it out and made it slimmer. Professor Lane was on that one. They also ported over a lot of Super Nintendo RPGs on the original DS. Chrono Trigger is obviously one of them, but I think most of the most of the Super Nintendo uh, what's it called Final Fantasies made their way to the DS. Game Boy Advance had a pretty nice library too though, on that note, because they're also ported over Super Nintendo titles too. Okay, let's hope he doesn't find me. Never played. I haven't played Castlevania since the DS ones. Not suitable music for this game, but fuck it. We're already getting stomped. Damn, did I just pick a wrong Masteries or something? This guy's has 30 damage a second. May I steal barely any? I started this fight with 280. Let's see if we can get a little bit more. Damn, doing Raptors cost me 40 HP, it looks like. And a little bit of time. Looks like he got the scuttle. One way to heal on Kha'Zix is. kills the scuttle. Because it doesn't fight back and it allows you to lifesteal. Or, I mean. Drain its life with the talisman. Or if you have machete, you get lifesteal off of it. And then when it does die, it gives you the HP. This one's gonna be hard, I think. I have smite. 300 HP, let's see if we can do it. I have red buff ticking. It's gonna be close. Oh, okay, it was close. I think. One more hit, or very close. Will I play I Am Setsuna? Probably not. I'm, not. I'm done with shitty, or I mean, I'm done with JRPGs with shitty stories. Like, it's just not as fun to watch either, but if you're not gonna give like a good story, like, it's just another JRPG. Oh shit. Oh, you're in trouble. Wow, Maokai's in trouble, fuck. He's down 12. Is it pushing out? Okay, it's pushing towards him. Damn, and I'm not gonna be near mid for that wave. Huh? Stop him! Maokai san! Get the fuck out of here. On your mighty wings. My wings are restless.
I'm going to always there, go refillable. Well, unless I'm doing a really weird jungle route that I want to farm more, but honestly, 50 gold is just too much of a hassle for jungles nowadays. And almost always, if I do buy triple pot at the start of the game, usually I go to refillable anyway, so I mean, yeah, you're already down quite a bit of gold if you use biscuits or potions, yeah. I don't know, I just find potions really rough to use. Compared to refillable. Is that better? Yeah, fuck it. Or I could wait. Oh no, I would have to wait 20, 20 more seconds for smite. I heard I am whatever. Set's not. I heard it's a pretty generic story. And after Tokyo Mirage sessions, I'm like, yeah, I could play a much better story, to be fair. Or maybe Horizon Zero might be cool. Or maybe FF15. And before it's bad, but. Like, I'm not expecting Mass Effect storytelling, but I mean. Like. Once you play a couple of JRPGs, you basically can guess what's going to go on. Like, I can guess half the time what happens in Token Mass Sessions. Do I have text to speech? I think if there's a swear word, it removes it, or not allowed. Technically, yes, I do. Fuck, Telly, are you leading him in right into me? Fuck sakes! Fuck, I'm dragging kills, I'm great. Just my fucking luck. Uh, runs right into fucking dragon, just my luck. Fuck, I wanted to kill this! Alright, she got what she deserves. She brought her problems to me and I have to fix it. Yeah, she died through Slifer, but what am I gonna do? Not my fucking fault, man. Fucking hell. Oh. You're fucking crazy. If they know we're here, we're done. Because Karma and Ash will double AoE this fresh and we die. Okay, never mind, we're free. Oh! Just fucking auto the guy! What was us doing? Anyway, that was actually good. I was actually surprised Karma didn't get the word there at all. Yeah, she's stealing my red, but I mean, like, we got so much from bottom, it's just, I can't stop him from stealing it, because. He probably knows I haven't been actually. I haven't been uh, in my jungle for about two minutes. So I might as well just clear this. Yeah, he's dead. What do you mean? He's probably already took it. Oh, he's in the midst of taking it. Wait, he didn't take it? Oh wow, I think he went to gank top. Or I'm about to walk into him. Okay. I'm fucking busy, Maokai. Really want to buy so I can actually kill this efficiently. Wow, uh, so Vulliver lost out a lot. Like, he needed to take my stuff. Like, my stuff was free right there. Because he knew me, Ezreal, and Thresh were bottom for sure. And I think Telia was having trouble with Brand. So, yeah, you could have, you should have tried to go for a huge steal on my stuff. Because I got way too much out of bottom. Dragging and, like, a couple of assists and a kill. Yeah, he needed to do something there.
I don't know if he realized how much he could have done. Will ever play Mountain Blade? I have no god damn it! I don't know! There's a lot of, yeah, high rated games on Steam. Which one's the best? Or which one's the best to watch? After it comes. Yeah, Kennen shouldn't have done the Lightland Storm there. Simply because. There's no point doing it while you're. Oh, what the hell? Fuck. I wanted someone else to get it, but then, like. It looked like he was gonna fl try to flash over, maybe? Oh, fuck. Damn, they don't notice. It's not the only thing they don't notice. Oh, shit! Another! Player 4 comes in! Player 4 is walking around! Still walking around! Oh, wow, Player 4 is pretty strong. Guess we'll take mid. Damn, they just got slaughtered. Good teleport. Which begs the question, where the hell is Volibear right now? I mean, the gameplay of Token Rass Sessions is interesting, but like, the story is so JRPG, it's like not even funny. You can tell it's going to be like some friendship BS. Every like The solution to every problem is friendship or something to that extent. Right. They don't even try to fucking hide it. So what's that, evil bad guy in the world? Oh, better fucking like... I don't know, just suck each other's dicks, call in friendship, do a song or something, and then everyone's happy. Man, I'm just bitter, but that's how it literally feels every every story mission. Yeah, I saw a rumor out on Steam where it's currently a top seller, I believe. I don't know how fun it is to watch, maybe I'll check it out one day soon too. JRPGs can have good stories, it's just a lot of them don't have to try because it's like harem animes, you don't have to try, you know? Like, people are gonna buy it anyway. <laughs> people will watch, buy it, whatever. <laughs> you really don't need like a winning story. It's like the Pixar problem as well. Pixar doesn't need to make an op. Because, or I mean, there's no point for them to make an op when they, they can make a shitty cars and make way more money. You can't have toys of like Upper Wally, you know? Oh fuck. That was Hadouken. Where's Malka this time? Fuck, uh, there's no TP this time. Damn, I guess they found me. I still hate that brand skin. The Q looks really weird. Like a Nocturne kill. I say it every time I see that skin. In the shadows. Can I be? Oh, what the hell? She's just a 1 in 5 person, I really don't care about those guys.
I forgot how Velber, I think Velber got double kill on bot lane. And it went to him. Then I think he got more kills off the Telio going ham. Yeah, it's sort of a silly subreddit post. Sounds uh, fascinating, I guess. Peace, motherfucking and Revenant Boy 69. Thank you for subscribing, man. Welcome to the average D Club. I'm trying to figure out which tower to push. We have three towers on them. Not enough awards. I sort of want Red Trunk at the. Got that going. I need Merc Treads now for sure, because they have Ash. Brand Cannon. Can 1v1 Cannonese. I'm pretty sure everyone can 1v1 them. What the fuck is this? What the? 187 MR, okay. really fucking see across the river. He's like, we gotta move into your jungle wall, which is very hard when there's no vision. I walk no, there's no way I'm walking into him, I have oracles. Oh shit, there is someone here. Oh fuck. Fuck! Yeah, I can't kill him when he's not isolated. Fuck, that was a lot of people. Ah, oh. Yeah, they got him. They got this. They got it. There we go. Fuck. Man, I shouldn't have jumped back on the Villa Bear. Because, yeah, I can't kill him. Unless he's isolated. Come and look at this damage. 340 if they're not isolated. 480 if they're... Wait, wait. Oh, never mind. No, 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 no. It's 700. <laughs> no, it's... Yeah, it's 700 damage if they're isolated. Okay, 700 damage if they're isolated. 340 if they're not, yeah. I, I was reading the wrong line, yeah. So the bottom line's the real one. So yeah, that's why everyone evolves Q first, because the damage scales an insane amount when they're isolated. The uh, Victor WC3, thanks for subscribing again, man. Welcome back. Dragons in three. We have two dragons, not a big deal. Yeah, my pink ward that was over here is gone now. Oh fuck. Well, I guess we're not touching it, huh? Not up you tour. Consume and adapt. There we go, we got a kill. Telia doesn't play like a moron, we got two kills. I guess I think she's gonna be more on, but. Talia, you useless sack of shit! Why don't you just alt in? What is she doing? Fuck, Talia! There we go. Holy shit. Way too troll, man. I think he was too busy. Oh no, he didn't even kill the ward. What the fuck? Yeah, all they had to do is just wall the wall. <laughs> Especially if Thresh is already going in, yeah. I just have to heal a little bit off that. That hurts. Can I? I 
I, I don't know if I'm just racist, but it looks more like Alistar Villever. Fuck these skins. Horses, hold your horses. Oh shit, hello. Fuck that. Oh, I thought he was gonna miss. Would not have been shocked if he did. Burnouts are awesome on Kha'Zix because he's one of the few jungles that actually builds a lot of damage. Did Ezreal die? Yes, he did. Did I get walled off by fucking Talia? Yes. Yes, I did. Fucking idiot. Do something, you ninny! Get rid of the isolation! There we go. There we go. Yeah, I'm really gonna help you push. Watch this. Oh, there's my E. Oh, okay. There you go. You happy, you fucking stupid tree? I'm so tanky because no one fucking aims at you, you dumb piece of crap! Why did he go all AP? Oh, they do have double AP. Okay, fine. I sh shall follow suit. Uh, I don't know. Like, a long, long time ago, there was, like, a standard for skins. But, yeah, some of the skins just look way too similar to other people. I think Le one of the LeBlanc skins looks similar to a, a Zyra skin, but, yeah. That Volibear skin looks way too much like Alistar. Maybe it's because of the physique. Yeah, a long time ago they actually give a shit, but I don't think so anymore. Oh yeah, there is it there a Caitlyn one that looks weird too? I don't know, it's because they, some of the characters have the same like physique or body type, so it looks real, like if you take away their props, suddenly they look exactly the same as someone else. If I don't get, what if I don't get reset, I'm done though. Oh, I didn't get a reset there, cause <laughs> she healed me. <laughs> oh, karma. That's good. Damn, I wish I landed on that. I would've got a reset. Fuck. Can't get near that bitch. the armor first, why not? No, this this Volibear skin I think is more muscular, like has proportions similar to Alistair I think. Maybe that's why the confusion's there.
Thrasher going in solo, I like it. I'm going too. Oh, what the fuck? Oh well, Malka, the one person we need here is not here. Actually, this might be a triple for Brand if we don't kill anyone. Fuck. Yeah, you better fucking kill him or I'm gonna die. You son of a bitch, I told you to kill him! Fuck! Fucking Malka, does he have mercs? No, he has Swifties. Thought he'd be stalled a little bit longer. There we go. Time to get rid of the bottle, maybe. No one does damage to you because everyone fucking ignores you and walks away. Step number three. Have them actually not ignore you every fight. Yeah, I don't know why Rise got a rework over <laughs> over Yori. <laughs> Yorick's like, yay, people still love me. The turret swap lane swap, stop lane swap, so we'll see. I'm assuming they've tested it and it would, but there are ways to do it. Oh fuck, can't touch that. Pull him. Okay, don't pull him. Just, just hang, hang loose, bro. Fuck, I really don't want to jump over that, but. Unless you get a CC down, I'm not jumping over. It's a really bad spot for me. Yeah, they need to CC him in place or else I'm gonna get stuck. Oh, okay, that's that's one. That's too screwed. Damn, I got that deleted. If they want, if Riot really wanted to make money, they'd just keep making Yasuo skins. I think he's one of those popular champs still, even if like I hate him every fucking game on my team. They literally should just do that. They should like even though they claim they don't like do skins of unpopular things, they might as well just do popular things and say fuck it. Cause I don't see why not. This isn't very efficient. Yeah, I think they're more careful about that though. I remember when Galio got a legendary skin, but they nerfed him the patch before, so no one picked Galio anymore, and then yes, Gatekeeper Galio is probably one of the worst selling skins. Fuck, you're still alive, buddy, huh? Okay, you're not alive. I really wanted to flash on it, but I don't have the boss to. I don't know, I didn't go TM at this game because this is a Ma Malmordius game. Like, even though he's 0 10, this guy is whatever. Like, those two specifically did magic damage, and they have karma, so. This is a very obvious. Oops. Very obvious, uh. Ma Malmordius game. And it's nice when you combine with Ghostway because of the armor pen. So, right now, my armor, flat armor pen's 38, so. Versus anyone that isn't stacking armor. I do quite a bit of damage. This is insurance, in case I do something yellow, Or if I get bursted down by ultimates. Time to truly cleave them. Doesn't really matter what my last item is, could have been death stance for all I care. Maybe I should, you know what, I should have went QSS, yeah. I got a Porygon from an egg. I need to go to the damn pier more often before the fad's over. I think the fad's slowly dying because the servers keep going down. Fucking servers.
I knew it was gonna for me. I just gotta figure a way to Yeah, there we go. Damn, two for two so far. Got him, boys. Oh, wow, I have 437 damage right now. Damn. Let's go. Oh, we have three fighters. Okay. Okay, that might be, might be a little busted. Okay. Just a little busted. But yeah, Inferno is probably the best for Kazakh, something to think. Yeah, I think out of all the, yeah, three Infernos would be insane for Kazakh. He doesn't really need Ocean. It's nice, but Poke Champion.